Justin and I hope you're enjoying my dad's videos. Make sure to share this video with your family and friends, like and subscribe and turn on post notifications so you get notified for all my dad's new videos. My social media will be tagged down below so you can follow it and just remember, Jesus loves you. Hey guys, um, just one little factor here um, before we start this video here today. Um, if for any reason my YouTube get, channel gets taken down, which could happen because we're, we're challenging the deep state and we're challenging the powers behind the scenes. But if it does get taken down, I'm going to share the link below here. We have a website, drcharlieward.co.uk and um, you can subscribe on there to our updates and our newsletters, etc. Um, that are being produced by Lee Hemmington. Um, and, but you'll be able to keep in touch with what's going on. So at the moment, everything is uh, nice, and, nice and smooth. But uh, for, if for any reason we get uh, taken down, you simply go to my website, drcharlieward.co.uk and register there and you'll get all the information as to where we are or where you can view our, our videos. Now, this is just a little thank you, really, a thank you to Donald Trump. And for all you haters out there, I want you to consider seven things. Firstly, I want you to consider that Donald Trump is the first president in his first term of office not to go to war against anybody. So we're uh, getting out of the endless wars. Now, let that sink in. The previous administrations were destroying Iran, Iraq, Syria, Afghanistan, Libya, many other countries. But you hate Donald Trump for not going to war against them. You seem to love the politicians that go out killing people. I think you need to reset your moral compass, but thank you, Donald, for that. It's much appreciated by those who understand you. Secondly, you're the first present president, certainly in my lifetime, that has tackled the elite paedophile gangs. At the crux of the theory is this belief that you are secretly saving the world from this satanic cult of pedophiles and cannibals. Does that sound like something you are behind? Or well, I haven't, I haven't heard that, but uh, is that supposed to be a bad thing or a good thing? I mean, you know, <laughs> if, uh, if I can help save the world from problems, I'm willing to do it. I'm willing to put myself out there. And we are, actually. We're saving the world from a radical left philosophy that will destroy this country. And when this country is gone, the rest of the world would follow. Most people in the world are completely oblivious to this because the mainstream media are complicit, so they hide it away. It's absolutely rife in Hollywood. You would know that. Uh, and in the Isles of Power. And I let them know, do anything and you'll be hit like you've never hit, be hit, been hit before. But just want to say thank you for taking them on and exposing them and removing them. You're the first president that I can remember that's, uh, is, is tackling child trafficking. As a parent, I speak on behalf of every parent in the world that has a soul. Thank you. There are so many children that go missing. 22,000 children go missing every single day. And you've, you've made it your duty to stop this happening. And for those of us who've lost children, we understand why. It's massively important. Um, but just, uh, just saying thank you from everybody, from the bottom of our hearts. Fourth, you're the first president to expose the Vatican and the Pope for what they really are. They don't worship God, they worship Satan. It's time to wake up to what they're really about. It's very, very sad when you wake up to the truth on issues like that because they've been held in high esteem for many, many years and then we find out they're not what we thought they were. You do your own investigation. They're corrupt to the core. 
Number five, is the first president to abolish payroll tax. Just let that sink in. He's saving his own people money from the corrupt world of debt and evil that surrounds us for years. It's a stepping stone in the right direction, but the media ignored it completely. Number six, you're the first president to arrest and charge corrupt royal households worldwide. Never been done before. Includes many, many countries. And finally, you're the first president ever to take on what we used to call the Illuminati, but you've rebranded to the deep state. The corrupt politicians, the cabals. You've taken them head on. You didn't need to. You're older than me, you've, and you've had a far better life than me, but you've given it all up to the American people to make the world a better place. And I'm just saying, on behalf of those who are be behind you right now, your digital warriors who are fighting your cause from behind the scenes. Thank you. Now ask yourself the question, you haters. What is there to hate about this man? Ask yourself that question. It's a simple question. Why do you hate a man that has not gone to war, who's tackled the elite paedophile gangs, who's tackled child trafficking, who's exposing corruption, abolishing payroll tax, arresting and charging corrupt royal households and taking on people who are evil. Just tell me what you hate. Thank you, Donald Trump. There's, from those of you who love you and appreciate you, thank you. Notified for all my dad's new videos. My social media will be tagged down below so you can follow it. And just remember, Jesus loves you.